played their 3,500th league game. All they needed to complete the celebrations was a win to keep them up with the third division promotion contenders. A nostalgic prelude to the match at Meadow Lane as Knott's manager Jimmy Cyril, who celebrated his 65th birthday last week, presented some of the club's famous former players with a special memento. There was a warm reception for men like Jeff Astle and Tony Hately, but the biggest cheer of all was for another of England's great centre-forwards, Tommy Lawton. So County had something to live up to, and with a sense of occasion, scored after two minutes. Paul Smalley, with room to manoeuvre, struck a great right foot shot, Bale keeper of Williams saved with his legs and McParland thumped in the rebound. County produced some flowing moves. McParland and Goodwin set up David Kevin, whose shot was saved at full stretch by Williams, who just foiled the onrushing weight. But then Kevin, Waite and McParland combined to put Goodwin through. But he let the ball run ahead of him, allowing Williams to smother at his feet. Smalley played another good ball into the box. Goodwin nodded down, Kevin tussled for it, and Goodwin's shot was deflected over. But County went two up, when Goodwin's challenge looked likely to lead to a whistle, but Downing played a smart through ball for McParland, whose pace and balance did the rest. Another Smalley long ball nearly gave McParland a first half hat-trick, his right foot volley dipping over the bar. The relaxing half-time atmosphere must have got through to County, who had a siesta at the start of the second half. Slackness let in John Bowden for a neatly taken goal. And County's dithering set up a chance for Jones. Dean Yates did enough to put him off, and the ball hit the post and miraculously rebounded to Leonard. But in the last 15 minutes, County came alive again. A weak goal kick went straight to David Thompson. His slithering centre was swept in by weight at the far post. McParland, looking for his hat-trick, was tripped in the box and got up to take the penalty himself. He joyfully struck it home to register his first hat-trick in league football to complete an enjoyable afternoon and great reunion and special memories for County's former England stars Tommy Lawton and Jackie Sewell. Well, we used to push each other around at one time, you know. He was bigger than I was, but... Uh, I used to push yourself out of the way, no, didn't you, we? No, I'm pushing, scoring goals, man. You get out of the way, it's my turn, that sort of thing. Well, that was the change. fun of it. We used to be great fun there. <laughs> and it never changes. It's always great to see him now and again, isn't it? What about it, though, Tommy? When you're watching a game, even now, do you get that feeling that, God, I wish I was out there playing? Well, you know, uh, I've always said, uh, ever since uh, I was taught by Dixie, uh, I always the Great play, Dixie Dean, that was. I always play a blind and sat in the stand. You see everybody else's mistakes, uh, and, uh, oh, if only I'd have been there, but uh, it's no good wishing, but they can never take your memories away from you. Early.